Adam 002, we need your help. This mission, if you choose to accept it, may involve you not coming home. <sighs> Where are we? Get up, get up, we need to get out of here. <gasps> Where are we? I have no idea. Welcome, Adam 002. I've been expecting you. You've fallen into my trap. Mwahahaha. <laughs> you are in my mass spectrometer. Here's a map, but I doubt it'll help you. Get ready for a little experiment. <laughs> Let the vaporization begin. And tonight on MTV Cribs, Doctor Evil's Don't torture lie. chamber. Yo yo yo! Welcome to my crib, my minions. I love accepting guests in a receiving room. You know, something with a little bling, a bang, you know, something that will make him wow and move and like, unicorns and rainbows and I'm a firm believer, first impressions last. Then you need something different, something unique, something that will set you apart from the rest of the evil community. Mine's a vaporized counter, which essentially sets up the items for the next phase by electrically heated metal coils give off electrons that are attracted to the electron trap, a positively charged plate. The particles are then bombarded with electrons. Bouncing off the atom's electrons, making the atom a positively charged ion. Now, I wonder. Now, if you just do damn thing, you Then the particles are accelerated, preparing them for the next phase of my plan, involving a magnet. Much better, altitude is irrelevant once your air. Now, my magnet tries to deflect these positively charged ions, and by the amount it is deflected, it determines how much junk it has in its trunk. The more junk the atom has, the less it'll be deflected. Finally, the positively charged ion is detected electronically, and information is tallied. By doing this whole procedure again and again, using the same elements, we can tell the abundance of the different isotopes. For example, we now know that 99.3% of all uranium is of the isotope U238. 
but we derive the atomic mass, which is 238.0289 by dividing the total mass with the number of ions tested. All of these measurements are based on the atomic mass of hydrogen, which equals 1. Pot, that's right. Uh, join. Well, that was my crit. So scram.